While Roger Federer was busy cyber-touring India, we were compiling the latest and greatest stories from around the tennis world. Hey tennis fans, I'm Blair Henley and welcome to the Tennis Now News Update. When Rafael Nadal announced he would be pulling out of the newly formed International Tennis Premier League set to launch in November, director Mahesh Bhupati found a suitable replacement. Roger Federer will now be playing for the Indian Aces in New Delhi and ask fans to Photoshop his likeness in popular Indian locales. The result was pretty hilarious. He ended up hiding from tigers, selling bananas, playing drums, trekking through the desert, chasing racket thieves, getting his ear pierced, and so much more. Good news for 18-year-old American Vicky Duval. She was diagnosed with Hodgkin's lymphoma back in July and is now officially cancer-free per this Instagram photo. We're looking forward to seeing her back on tour. Another day, another poker promo from Rafa Nadal as he readies for his showdown with soccer star Ronaldo in November. Here's a look at Nadal trying to answer questions while playing a hand. It went about as well as you might imagine. Well underscore maybe, well maybe. Uh, says if you could only bring three things to a desert island, what three things would they be? We need the um, football ball maybe. Football ball maybe. That's good ball. Yeah. <laughs> and maybe computer. With, wow. a, with a Wi-Fi. <laughs> they have Wi-Fi. Yeah, and then Oh, that's, just, that's ugly. <laughs> that is ugly. That was a tough one. That was really tough. <laughs> no way. You okay? <laughs> Speaking of Rafa, he made his return to the court this week in Kazakhstan. Well, sort of. He joined Joe Wilfried Sanga in an exhibition doubles match with some pint-sized partners. I had a face to face excellent Mikul Tsonga, Louis Nadal. Smulgând admirația sălii și meciul este câștigat de Tsonga, cu micul Tsonga, foarte fericit, băiețel care îl bate pe Nadal. And as for that right wrist issue, it looks to be just fine. You may not know 23-year-old Yarmir Jenkins, but after this video, you certainly won't forget him. Currently ranked in the top 300, the former college standout posted the link to his Facebook page asking, has anyone ever embarrassed yourself like I did today? Sabine Lasicki celebrated her 25th birthday in Wuhan, China, and the fans got into the act. Check it out. <laughs> Caroline Wozniacki posted a Throwback Thursday Instagram video showing off her moves in the boxing ring. And now we know why Rory broke up over the phone. Wozniacki also recently posted this photo from inside her private jet. Meanwhile, Maria Sharapova apparently flew coach after her early exit in Wuhan. She spotted the passenger in front of her reading up on her loss, tweeting, Hey buddy, I'm right behind you. If you've ever wondered what it would be like to luxuriate in the best hotels the world has to offer, Serena Williams summed it up in one spectacularly random Instagram video of her own. Behold the magic toilet seat. Uh -huh. Abracadabra. <laughs> Abracadabra. <laughs> Laura Robson may still be out with a wrist injury, but she's been busy on the business side of her career. After years with Adidas, she's now repping Nike. She announced the switch with an Instagram post. With fellow Canadian Jeannie Bouchard as his inspiration, we're guessing, Justin Bieber has been working on his tennis game. He posted a video of his first tennis lesson at the Beverly Hills Country Club. Okay. 
That's all for today's Tennis Now News Update. Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you don't miss a thing. We'll see you next time here on Tennis Now.